A recent study shows the number of vascular dementia cases is on the decline. Researchers say the decline could be a result of people taking better care of their hearts. SNN's Allison Henning spoke with a Suncoast medical professional who says he isn't surprised by the findings. The prevalence of dementia is expected to climb as the average life expectancy increases. But findings from a study published in the New England Journal of Medicine shows the risk of developing it plummeting 20 percent per decade since 1975. Throughout the study, researchers analyzed 30 years worth of data from 5,200 participants. The uh, most common cause of mild cognitive impairment, which is something that can lead to dementia, uh, is vascular. Geriatrician Bruce Robinson with Sarasota Memorial Hospital says the findings of the study aren't surprising. He says people have come a long way in terms of managing cardiovascular risk factors such as smoking and an unhealthy diet. We're all also very clear that regular physical exercise is important and I think the exercise habits of the country as, as a whole have changed dramatically. Dr. Robinson says one factor you can't control is your age. Being old is the big story about the likelihood of having dementia. Dr. Robinson says taking care of your heart when you're young could save your brain cells later on in life. Regular physical activity, a healthy diet, keeping your weight within a reasonable range and not smoking. All those are critical choices that you make early on that may help you keep your brain when you get old. Reporting in Sarasota, Allison Henning, SNN, the Suncoast News Network. Though the incidence of dementia declined in the past 30 years, the conclusion of the study says the contributing factors have not been entirely identified.